hey guys, this is Vandex here. Today I'll be teaching you guys on how to play Nintendo 3DS games on your Mac or Windows. To play Nintendo 3DS games on your Mac or Windows, we will need this emulator which is known as Citra. Citra is an emulator which is pretty good actually. It helps you to play 3DS games. Now firstly what you have to do to get Citra is go to your Safari and search Citra. So I've searched it up and here Citra. So open up the site and Citra is right here. So download for Windows, Mac and Linux and download it. So once you've downloaded it, install Citra. You can download any version. Uh, there are two versions of Citra currently available. Canary, which is the experimental version. Uh, it is the version which I don't recommend using. So uh, it's better you go uh, ahead with Nightly, which is the second version, which has been tested out. Citra's frame rate depends on your own device. Like if your Mac has pretty good graphics card, then it will give you pretty good uh, performance uh, on basis of FPS. So once you've downloaded and installed it, open it up as I have already. So I will be showing that process now. Open up Citra, and as you can see, it shows this weird terminal command. And for people using Windows, you have to download. Visual CC to be able to run Citra, otherwise it won't run. So download Visual CC before you can. I recommend I recommend Visual CC uh, downloading Visual CC because I've seen I don't own a uh, Windows myself, so I'm not sure about Windows. So you can go ahead and check out other tutorials for whether you it's necessary download visual cc or not but according to the information that i have gathered you have to download visual cc and once it's done so this is my citra i've loaded up to play games uh, you can play them two ways first click on load file and select your game file or another way is just click here and this is where my game file is and i'll just drag this I'm just not dragging hates me my game file hates me lol okay so i just dragged it up and so and the game should be beginning and as you can see it has begun Woo. so this game is pokemon omega ruby and I have taken this file from my Nintendo 3DS. You guys can download it from the internet. It's freely available. So let me just close it up for now. So for people using Windows, for the fix, what you have to do is that Citra has a big problem. That when uh, it is only allowed to run games which have been dumped, what is dumping? Dumping is taking the files from your Nintendo 3DS or any other platform and bringing it to another platform or saving it on your PC or laptop. So that's dumping. You can go ahead and so if you have a Nintendo 3DS, just go ahead and check out dumping tutorials. And if you don't, then you always have to download uh, files from the internet but they won't run because Citra has a problem because if Citra wants to continue on Citra can't allow these files to be run because most games some games will be okay with the Citra I'm not sure about I don't me myself I don't know many games which I would like to play which are like open so can can be played in this way so I would I downloaded Citra because I had wanted to play Pokemon and that's the reason most of the people do it anyway so what you always have to do is that for Windows user as I don't have a Windows I can't tell you I can't show you the process but I can tell you the process 
So first download the use of the folder that I have downloaded given you in the description. So once you have downloaded it up, it's called a user folder. I am not sure what its name is but just open it up and you'll see four files. Copy those files and then what you gotta do is that go to now select your start button and then select control panel and appearance then go to personalization then select folder options then select view tab under advanced settings select show hidden files folders and drives and then select ok once you've done that you might you will be able to see your local folder open search for your search for a folder in your computer known as local it's a administrator uh, folder so you won't be able to see it that easily so once you have done once you're done with it now open then you will see another folder which shows so says citra mu now click on citra mu and then you can see for four files delete those four files and paste the four files four or three files it depends like i saw four files in mine so once you're done deleting them then paste the four files that i have given you and that should fix all the problems you have with citra and as for mac users for what you guys have to do is open up your terminal and you also have to download some files that i've given in the description then what you guys have to do is open up your terminal and paste this command that i'm giving you and then press on enter once it's done oh sorry firstly you go yes it's okay so it's once you have pasted uh, I have to paste the command again as I didn't want to mistake so first press enter then paste the command and as you can see the command has been executed as it has given me another row so it means it has been executed so this command allows you to see all the hidden files in your Mac so once it's done close the terminal up because there's no need now click on finder and click on go and here you can see this option which is known as home local folder this folder right here now click on this folder click on share click on citra mu and copy and and delete all these four files as i've already done the process i won't be doing it again because if i do it i lose my pokemon save data so just copy just copy just copy the files that i've given you guys and paste these four files here once it's done your citra should just start working as for the roms for roms all you guys have to do is open your pure browser again and write 3ds decrypted rom here you can find with decrypted roms for 3ds but i'm warning you guys do not download cia cia is another type of roms which are available on the internet but i recommend downloading 3ds decrypted roms because 3ds decrypted roms are the only one that will easily work with citra because the cias are available but cias are difficult to run so i recommend downloading those decrypted roms so this is my favorite site to download this is zippato so hey you guys can go ahead and search whichever rom you want and download it up so thank you guys for watching Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake